This computer terminal provides full access to the LCARS computer net. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh yeah! Alright guys, welcome to the LCARS ADV subspace channel. Welcome aboard. Well, today we're drinking a little orange Kool-Aid and we're picking up a new bike. Stay tuned. We're at Hebler's in Lockport, New York. There she is. KTM Venture 390. There she is, brand spanking new. KTM Venture 390, 2022. All right, well, she even looks more beautiful in person than she did on the website. Oh yeah, I can't wait to uh, get on the saddle of this thing. All right, we just got her home. Uh, just got, I picked it up in Lockport, New York, so I had to drive it an hour and a half to get it home. But here we are, here is the 2022 KTM 390 Adventure. So I am uh, really psyched about this bike. I haven't even ridden it yet, so I literally just roll it off the truck. But my, my first impressions are is, wow, she looks beautiful. I actually loving this color scheme. The build quality seems really nice. So um, yeah, I'm really psyched about this bike and I'm um, loving the, uh, the TFT uh, screen on this. That is so cool. But um, yeah, I mean, this is, this is awesome. This is my first adventure bike. Um, I have had lots of motorcycles over the years. Um, my last really fast bike was the Yamaha FC09, so, but I got rid of street bikes and uh, I just see too many people go splat. And um, so I went to dirt bikes and uh, that's right in the GPX. But, uh, but I went on a adventure ride in Death Valley in February and I really like the idea of adventure riding, camping off the bike and just and having the ability to do stuff like that, maybe some BDR stuff. So I'm really psyched about maybe getting into that stuff. So that's kind of why I bought this. And um, I um, really, um, it was hard. I had a lot of bikes to choose from. There's a lot of stuff out there, but this one seemed to be the best value and it had a lot of stuff already on it, the tech on it, the off-road capability and the on-road capability. And it's, you know, no bike is going to be perfect and no bike is going to be, you know, perfect at one thing and perfect at the other thing too. So, but you have to find this balance and what I was looking for was capable and this bike, you know, checked all the boxes and the price was right too. So that's kind of why I bought this. And, um, but uh, I never thought I would drink the orange Kool-Aid, honestly, but, <laughs> but here we are. I'm not getting a KTM dirt bike. Understand this. <laughs> <laughs> so, but uh, yeah, that's kind of why we picked this up so we can do some adventure riding. And um, I'm hoping to, uh, you know, obviously it's the end of the riding season here in Western New York. So we have to wait till next year to do a lot of this stuff. But uh, yeah, so really loving the build quality of this bike here. So I can't wait to get out and try it. Um, but yeah, so there you go. That is the. You know, my initial pull it out of the off the truck into the garage impressions of the KTM 390 Adventure. <laughs> All right, live long and ride.